letters and this is how to tell if your toad is a male or a female. I have two Fowler's toads here and then I have in here two cane toads I'm going to show you. These are both males and I'll show you how I know that and then my cane toads are females. So the way you tell if they are a male is simple. Put them in a position where you can see their neck. So you can tell that this guy is a male because he has a black neck right there as you can see. And um, the females just have the same color as their belly. So it's probably just gonna be all white or all cream. These guys have a black or brown neck for when they croak, their mating calls. I'm gonna show you another example of this little guy. So, here's him. Again, black neck or gray neck. So yeah, right here I have two males. Now I'm going to show you my big cane toads, which have the same color, so they must be female. So I have to open this big container up. I'm just going to put these guys in their log right here so they can hang out. I'm going to keep an eye on them. So I'm going to open this. Here's my cane toad's habitat, and they're both in here. Here they are. Okay, so this guy right here will be my example. She, I bought her on Backwater Reptiles. She's an amazing toad, very big as you can see. They are actually the second biggest frog slash toad in the world, besides the Goliath frog. So pretty much the biggest toad. I'm gonna keep him away from, I'm gonna keep her away from my little Fowler's toes so uh, she doesn't try to eat them, that would be bad. I'm going to try to get a view of her neck. As you can see, it's the same speckled and white coloration as her body. There's no change in the colors. There's no black. It's just the same. So that's how you can tell. So I'm going to put her back in there. And I'm going to put their uh, little house. Sorry, I know you don't really like this cage, but it's all I got. These guys are selfish. But I love them. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. So back to my little guys, little Fowler's toads. They're hiding in their little log. So yeah, that's how to tell the difference between male and female toads. A quick summary, 
females have the same color on their neck and their stomach. So let's say they have a cream neck and a cream stomach, or a speckled neck and a speckled stomach, or a gray neck and a gray stomach. Same color, right? Then the males have a different story. They have a black or gray neck, different color neck, than their body. Their body might be speckled or white or cream, but their necks are black, gray, or brown. That's because they have to do their mating call, while females do not. Thanks for watching. Hope you learned something.